Good day royal fans, today's royal installment. Meghan Markle and Prince Harry's plans to reconcile with the royal family have been thrown into the air. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex had hoped to turn 2023 into a year of reconciliation, according to numerous reports. However, Matt Wilkinson, royal editor, claimed that these plans are now in tatters in the wake of the Queen's death. He explained that the couple has had to go back to the drawing board. There are fears that Harry's upcoming memoir and the Sussex's Netflix docuseries could plunge their relationship with the royal family to a new low. Mr. Wilkinson said, the couple's planned year of reconciliation in 2023 was penciled in before the Queen died. He added, they had plans for Harry's book and the plans for the Netflix TV show, which is coming out in December. The royal experts said the Sussexes were being forced to redraft their PR plans following the death of Queen Elizabeth II last month. Mr. Wilkinson continued, their PR plans were originally to bring out the book and the TV program and then next year try to smooth things over and have a reconciliation. If this book or TV show is critical of Trolls and Camilla, they are then criticizing the monarchy, which they were not going to do originally. It has really thrown it up in the air for them. They had these carefully laid out plans. They had gotten rid of their Hollywood PR teams. Now they are having to go back to the drawing board. This comes as Netflix remains keen for the couple's much hyped docuseries to drop in December, following the Crown's latest season in November. However, the Duke and Duchess are reported to be requesting changes and late edits even possibly a postponed release until next year, according to the Times. Meanwhile, Vanity Fair's Katie Nicole claimed that King Charles is absolutely devastated by his tense relationship with his youngest son, Harry. She said that Charles remains hopeful of a reconciliation with his son, the royal author added. I think we saw that in the very public olive branches that were extended to Harry and Meghan. All right, that's our news for today, guys. What do you think? Leave your comments below, like and subscribe for more, and goodbye for now.